Uh, it's a pain in the ass to be with you right now, but guys, welcome to Seattle Sonics basketball. Um, definitely want to get a video in. Didn't know how I was going to do it because um, Streamlabs is acting a monkey right now, so it's like kind of weird. I uh, wanted to uh, get everything back up to... Uh, Wanted to do a uh, live stream on my Facebook page, and I went to go switch to my Facebook page off of YouTube, um, but it acted up and took all my settings out, my volumes, my scenes, all that stuff, my sources, took them all out, and I had to re-go back into YouTube to uh, get everything back right with Streamlabs, which is kind of cool, which is cool. At least everything's back up and working, but at the same time, the... I wanted to do a, a stream on my Facebook page, and I can't do it. I don't understand if you have two accounts, you can't be logged into one account and just do that one and be able to stream off that one. And what if you're not even streaming? You're just recording a video like I am with this one. I'm just going to put this up on YouTube. I don't understand why it does all that, but it's not my software. So I have to deal with I just got to deal with it, whatever, however I can. Um... Right now, guys, we are over 500, 37, 36. So we're still looking up at the Timberwolves who beat us a couple of games ago. Um, but, you know, I'm waiting for them to lose a game. Have they lost lately? Let me just check and see how, how, um, how they're doing. I think they'll tell me. Right here. You got to love this game because they do go into detail. They did lose to the Rockets, but mostly they've been winning. They beat us. They're on a winning streak. They lost to the Rockets, and then they beat the Nets. So we're looking for them to lose, and they're not losing a lot. Compared to us, you look at what we've done. Of course, we just had a loss to the Grizzlies, John Morant. You know, decided uh, I'm not going to carry that gun. I'm going to actually play ball and kill you. And that's what they did. He did 29 points. We played the Bucks. We got that win. I love watching that game. That was a really good game. We beat the Celtics. That was really cool. The Bobcats, the Raptors. We did have a winning streak going. You know, of course, we lost to the Thunder and the Timberwolves. But we rattled off some wins before we lost to the Grizzlies. Um, another thing that hurts us is, of course, the injury to – the injury to uh, Tristan Thompson, not a good time to get an injury right now. We really need him off the bench as our uh, as our center, and he's going to be out with a broken nose. Like, dude, wear a mask and come back in the game. <laughs> I need you right now, Tristan. This is not the time for an injury, but the band plays on. The band will play on, you know, we'll play. And the thing I'm going to do, of course, I gave Suggs more minutes. He's close to 30. I got Bridges 30. I got Williams 30. Everybody else is about the same. I got Harris down to 16. James down up to still at 24. Crowder is um, cold, but I, I don't have any other power forwards because I got Grant Williams playing the center position because Tristan Thompson is injured. So there's really nothing I can do. This is basically the lineup we're going with. Can't do anything about it. Grant Williams does have, uh, is hot, but I'm still going to leave all the minutes up to Williams. Um, we're just going to roll with whatever we got and see if we can get this win versus the Nuggets. It's important we beat the Nuggets because um, we don't want them taking our place right now. Plus, we need to win, and we need the uh, Timberwolves to lose. So, right now, that's what we're playing. We got nine games left. I figure I'd do this Nuggets game, and then the Nets come up, and the Bobcats and the Nuggets and all that. I, I don't know whether we're going to win or not, man. I mean, we need the Timberwolves to lose some games right now. and That seems to not be happening. And we got the injury to Tristan Thompson, so this is – it's not looking good. And we will play. Um, then I'm going to take all those practices off. We, I wanted them to practice for this game because this game is really important. Uh, we really need this game. Can we get it? They got two studs, man. And then you have Michael Porter Jr. 
Um, they got some. They got really good pieces, man. I think I'm just gonna do that. Just our regular uniforms. Denver's the it team, I guess, man. I, I mean, people, people like Denver, man. I mean, has Denver ever done anything? I mean, really, in the annals of uh, pro basketball, have they really done anything in the NBA to be, like, up there? They always seem to be a team that never really does anything. They have good teams, but they just never seem to be the team, like, that will, you know, be that top team. And I don't understand how this team is under 500 with all that talent on that team. But uh, we're going to get to this game. Despite all the uh, kerfuffles with the soft, with the streaming software we have. Oh, my God, I hate it. Too loud. Definitely need this win, man. Plenty of heart and hustle in that regard. I mean, they made sure they hit the glass hard and off. Now let's take a look at Denver's opening line. Whoever is out there with Jamal Murray. Then there's Anderson. Then it's Michael Ford. Pass the ball, that sucks. No. Free off target. Had some space there after the little bump it. Stone. Good defense by Suggs. Get in there. No. Okay, well, let's check in with David Aldridge, who's the from the sideline. Thanks, guys. Yeah, Seattle's head coach and I did get the chance to chat. He told me one thing that we're going to get the most of the Messing up already. He said it's easy to... Messing up already might be a good omen for us. Um, yeah, I figure after this video, the last video of the season, the Nets game will be the next video. Um... I was slow in trying to get to the, through the season because the team kept winning. And we looked good. We didn't look good against the Grizzlies, of course, because they're the Grizzlies. But other than that, we were really doing really good, and we kept our shot. But uh, <laughs> I'm trying to get to the end of the season, but at the same time, I'm trying to soak it all in, trying to enjoy – I think we've had a really good season. I didn't. I don't know. I didn't think we'd make. I mean, there was a time when I really did think we'd make the playoffs. So it wouldn't shock me if we did make the playoffs. Get that three, Suggs. He's gonna get better, but uh, I'm just, I'm just sort of disappointed in like, I'm just sort of disappointed in just like. I feel like with my videos, I feel like that, oh, God. With my videos, yep, help defense. I did put that in there to help on defense, but not to just, I don't know. But uh, I feel like I'm just frustrated with the videos sometimes because I feel like, okay, I want to put up more videos, but at the same time, you get tired of having to set this stuff up. And deal with software. Oh God, Elden James not hitting anything. Um, Standing up with uh, software that doesn't work the way it should. And yeah, how in the hell are they under five hundred? How the hell are you under five hundred? And you got Nikolai Jokic, you got Jamal Murray, Weaver Jr. And they, and they got talent on the uh, on the bench. I mean, there is no way. But yeah, I would be I would love for this team to make the playoffs. Um, especially getting those two big free agents I got. Oh man, it'd be great. With the young talent. Yeah, it'd be a great story if Seattle can get to the playoffs, man. It'd be great. And that's a Harris is not gonna that's a mismatch. Michael Porter is definitely a mismatch for Gary Harris. 
Absolutely. But yeah, I just, you know, as far as that content and stuff like that, trying to get videos in, it is kind of painful, man, because you want to do the stuff, but at the same time, you just want a game. You don't want to have to set up the, the webcam and the video and the software has got to act right. You got to load the video and stuff. And this is stuff I do basically for kicks. I don't do it to make money. I wish I made money doing it. Um, but I don't know. I'm just a novice when it comes to this stuff. But I love I love gaming. It gives me a sports outlet. It gives me a chance to put a team together. So I do like that part. Oh, that's a good alley -oop. I knew they were going to that play. We need this win, man. Um, got to hold off Denver, and we got to hope the Timberwolves lose, of course. Um, I am going to do a Mike Cobbs video. I will post that video, of course, on YouTube. Um, I just don't want to stream it on YouTube. And if I can't, if I can't stream it on my uh, face, my Solo Dollar Sports Facebook page, probably won't stream it. I'll probably just record it and uh, post it on my Facebook site and post it on YouTube. And I think that's the only way I can do it. Because if I live stream it, I don't, I don't think you guys will. I don't think I'll get a lot of viewers over over here. Because I don't think you guys are interested in my Madden stuff right now. I think you're more interested in, of course, the basketball team and what the Sonics do. Even though I didn't even get that many views with the last video. I think I got five views. And I'm like, really? it was getting 20-something odd views. So maybe y'all waiting for the, y'all wanting this season to end. You know, like, okay, you're going to make the playoffs or not? It's like, yeah, I kind of – I. In a way, I kind of wanted to be a cliffhanger. Ooh, good defense by Robert Williams. Look at Harris. Look at Harris, man. Harris, I actually do want to keep. I think I did. I think I did sign him for another year in the contract extension. I think I did do that. I did re-sign him. I said, you know, I think he'd be good. On the coming off the bench, Harris is good coming off the bench, but I do think I need another starting uh, shooting guard. And Suggs is feeling it, man. Suggs is feeling it. We need this game, bro. We really need it. We have to keep. We have to keep pace. Good steal. Good defense by the Sonics. Ah, oh, and I thought he'd miss it. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about right there, boy. Seattle ain't playing, boy. We're coming. We are coming. You know he's going to get better. You know he's going to get better. But I do worry, of course, about Jamal Murray. That's one of my biggest concerns. But right now, Suggs is hot. That's what we need. We need him to be hot. But Jamal Murray doesn't have to be hot. He'll just make shots anyway. <laughs> a, lot of, a lot of game left. Um, ah! Yes! And if we – he's got 16 points right now. He might have one of those games that you just go, yeah, this is going to be one of those big games. you got to get back defensively. Luckily, he did not make that. Jamal Murray, last six games. Yeah, he's been tearing it up. He's been tearing it up. Um, love seeing that. Um – I am going to do something with the show, though, but I don't know. I need some series to wind down, like Mike Cobbs. I, I, I still, I think with Mike Cobbs, I still want to do, like, oh, that's a bad turnover. I still want to do another season with it. I really enjoyed playing on All Madden with Mike Cobbs. It was really fun. I threw a lot of, threw a lot of interceptions, but it was fun. You know, I enjoyed it. 
Enjoyed the gameplay. It felt like a real game. Oh, come on. Bridges. The rebound. Oh, man. You gotta play good defensively. Yep, I have stress getting rebounds. Get those rebounds. Here comes Williams. And he gets it. Grant Williams, boy. Heck yeah. Hey, Jokic still out there? Oh, uh, Murray's wide open. Yep, number net. And what do you guys think about college basketball right now? Are you just like me? You're just sort of like, eh. You don't pay attention to college basketball. It's just the funniest thing. I can watch college football all day. It doesn't even matter if Michigan State is sorry. I can watch college football all day long. College basketball, I just can't I just can't do it, man. I just don't I don't know why. You would think I'd be into it. I mean, I was watching like college women's softball instead of college basketball. And I don't know why. I just well, I know why for that. That's that's obvious. But but uh yeah, I mean I just don't get, I haven't really got into college basketball. I'm like, if Michigan State's not really doing really well, I just don't watch it. Um, I think Tennessee, I don't think Tennessee, I think Tennessee lost to Missouri too. How the hell you lose to Missouri? Oh, good. Stayed with it, man. I like that. Quartz Moz. I think that was another difference, man. We got rid of Tony Snell and brought in Quartz Moz, man. Of course, Moss is really good off the bench. And this is not a good matchup. But he's wide wide open. And he didn't drain it. I'm shocked. And Jokic, man. Oh, my. You can't let him get inside, man. You let Jokic get inside, you're done. He said he won, he's winning. He's going to win another. I never. And I don't pay attention too much to the NBA either. As much as you would think. Like, Jokic, I learned Jokic uh, is up for another MVP. And I'm like, when did he win the first one? I mean, I just don't I don't pay attention to it, man. It's like, well, the thing about basketball, especially NBA, it really kind of doesn't really get really good to the playoffs. Like, the NBA's playoffs is really great. I like the playoffs, and I'll pay attention. But as far as, like, the regular season, it's like, no, not really. Oh, Burke, what was that? What was that, Burke? By himself. And we're letting him get rebounds. We're letting him get too many rebounds. And they repeatedly falls inside in the first half, guys. And it's paid off. Oh, that hard start, man. Got the foul. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, um, I'm gonna see. I can switch. I'm gonna switch this and see if I can stream over on my Facebook page for that Mike Cobbs video. Of course, I got to sell all this stuff up in my other room with my Xbox One because I got the Switch in here. I don't feel like moving it. Then I got the Series S in here. I don't feel like moving it. So I got it all set up in my other room so I can stream it. Last game of the season, I have to beat the Falcons in order to make the playoffs. It, was, it should be a fun time. Ooh, Crowder. <coughs> Not bad. At least didn't make the shot. Good job, buddy. Crowder's been playing better, too. He's good as far as rebounding and being tough defensively. I mean, I'm, you don't want him shooting. 
Because most of the time he's not going to make it. Because he's Jay Crowder. But we came out gut. Came, we came out gangbusters in that first quarter. If, if Suggs is playing at this pace, man, don't see us losing. Now, of course, I'm going to sim it to the fourth quarter, and it could be a complete wash. Okay, Williams, come out. Pass to somebody else. Hey, for Burke to take this shot, but he's going to take it, of course. Murray. No, but we're letting him get rebounds again. Come on, yeah. That's what I need from you, Williams. Get the rebounds. Come on, guys. Let's end this quarter good. Let's end the quarter good. No, come on. But he have something in his eye. <laughs> he got something in his eye. No, he's he's Grant Williams. <laughs> he has something in his eye. He's Grant Williams. That one is Blood is trailed by four. Passes up the Vincent. Murray scanning the floor. Here's Roger. No. Good. Yes, sir. I like it. We're at home. You know, our home crowd is really good. They're interested in Seattle basketball again. You know, they can't believe they got Seattle Sonic basketball back. I think we can do it. Yeah, it's all good, but um, they didn't say the other part. We let them get too many rebounds, so they got back in the game because we gave up offensive rebounds. Stuff you can't do. But can we make this a four-quarter game? I mean, if it's close in the fourth quarter, I like our chances, but they have a good lead in the fourth quarter. We're done because they got too many shooters. Like you got Jamal Murray, you got Nikolai Jokic. I mean, you got to play out of your mind. But I did do the right thing. I gave... Suggs a lot of minutes. Probably should have gave him more. And right now it's a dog fight. It's a dog fight. Come on. Come on, Sonics. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. There we go. There we go right there. We really need this game. Yes. Three minutes and 35 seconds to go. This is what we needed. No. No, you're going to saw. Porter Jr. No. Good rebound by Jay Crowder. Williams. Yes. Robert Williams. What a way to recover after that Grizzlies loss, man. No. Ah, not making it. Jay Crowder, home. Oh. <laughs> that wasn't bad. At least he went to the rim. He went to the rim, so I give him that. <coughs> Man. Jokic, no, you're not going to. That's a mismatch. 
But man, we need this guy. I don't know. Smart me wants to go ahead and go to the Nets game and just go ahead and end the season. But I'm kind of liking the fact that it's drawn out. You don't know if we're going to make it. We could. You never know. i kind of glad. I want to keep suspension up because I would love, 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 love for us to make the playoffs, man. That'd be great. Second year in, and it was a dogfight to get in. Good young basketball team. Tador, no. I really don't want him shooting, man. But we need him to shoot. Oh. Well, they're going to give me player of the game. Cool. Jalen. I love that it's been a hard charging performance. 19 points. Boy, you mean he only scored three points the whole rest of the game? Get in there, Suggs. Get in there, Suggs. Get in there, Suggs. Ten point lead. We're coming. We're getting the dub. Man, that's just too much. Murray's just too much for anybody. No. That's your shot, man. But it's done. Yeah, it's done. We did the job. They did their job, man. We needed that win, and we got it. Got to keep them. Got to keep them out of that knock spot. That's what we did. Sonic, Seattle people are happy. We're happy. And we did it without Tristan in the lineup. Gotta love it, man. Gotta love it. Heck yeah. Man, I think we can do it, man. I think we can do it. Good young team, man. Playing at the right time. With an injury, man. With one of our biggest injuries. 22 points, 6 rebounds, 4 assists, 4 steals. 4 of 7 from the 3-point line. 9 of 16 from the field goal range. Jalen Suggs, man. Awesome. 19 points, 3 rebounds, and assist For uh, Miles Bridges. Had an off night shooting the 3, though. Really off night. Terrible. Got the win. Eldon James, yeah, 11 points, two rebounds, four assists. Burke, nine points, one rebound. Williams, 15, 15 boards, man, three of five. Pretty decent right there. Man comes in, shoots a little bit. Gary Harris, five points. Don't expect much from him. Five points for the Heat. Tudor was off. Jake Crowder doing the dirty work, five rebounds. No blocks, though, no steals either. Yeah, two turnovers too. Greg Williams playing that uh that center position for a he only played 18 minutes, though. I have him only in there for 18 minutes, but he didn't do much. But he didn't do too bad. Like I said, I'm giving most of the minutes at center to uh, Robert Williams. Nuggets, man. Jokic was actually not that great. He did have a double double, but 19 points. We expect a little more from them. Jamal Murray was off, too. We just got lucky. We played them at the right time. They were off. 
they were off, man. They were off, and we took advantage. 90 to 82. Won the first quarter. They won the second quarter. They barely won the third quarter. We won the um, fourth quarter big. Total game, making some of our three points. They were five for 34 from three points. Um, fast break points won that. Points and paint even. Uh, rebound edge. No, I ain't got the rebound edge. Second chance points went to them. Bench points went to us. Sis. Rebounds. They out rebounded us, man. They did. But we got the win. Don't know how we did it, but we got the win. And I'm just thankful for that. I don't give a damn. Win's a win. Win is a win. You take them when you can get them. That was one win I'm glad we got. We'll look at the schedule now. I think what we do now is we rest some guys. We've got um, to play the Trailblazers. We're well under 500. Probably going to pay for this later, but we are going to take a rest day. Rest everybody up. And I'll probably have a rest day for April 1st day, too. Rest everybody up for that. Might have a practice for the Bobcats. Might not. Try to get us some uh, get us some rest. 22 points for uh, Suggs. Team's playing really good, though. We're two games over 500, 38 and 36. But the Timberwolves are 40 and 32, man. It may just be too late, man. A little too late to get that eighth spot. We're close, but, man. We need a lot of things to go our way. How's everybody feeling right now? Suggs is hot. Still cold. Right now, I'm going to keep everything where it's at. Not going to change anything. Just going to roll with it. See what happens. In the playoff picture. We're right there, man. It's just... It's just probably too little too late, man. They beat the Wild. So, they beat them badly, too. They beat the Nets badly, too, man. Oh, my God. They just have... They just... They just probably... It's just probably too late. A little too little, too little too late. I need them to drop some games, and they're not doing it. But... I don't know. Maybe I get to the last game of the season. Maybe I want to watch a little bit more and take my time with it, see if we just make the playoffs. I don't know. It's going to be a short video today, guys. Uh, just wanted to see if we can get that game against Denver and hold that ninth position. But for the most part, um, I'm just slowly watching the season. I'm not in a hurry. I'll be on this game for a while. But um, can we make the playoffs? I don't know. Need the Timberwolves to lose, man. And but I'm really impressed on how good this team's been this season. We'll just have to see what happens Happens in the next few games. Guys, thank y'all for joining me for Seattle Sonics basketball. See you guys later. Peace.